Hi, my name is John, and in this video I will show you how to edit this template. This is the 04 accessible tabs. Um, you can see that this template okay, work with the keyword, okay, on focus for the, uh, the tabs. Um, you can set with tab, okay, and navigate with arrows uh, up and down. You can see that this, this work with the keywords and um, on the HTML you can see on this okay for this button the row tab uh, type button area control and the um, area select in this case is true but uh, now in the next this um, in this button okay area selected is false and uh, this is accessible and work with the keywords remember that uh, to focus with tab and navigate with the arrows is the way to uh, navigate with the keyword okay for edit this um, you can go to the template Okay, this is the template. Uh, it's very very important. In this case, this this heading. Okay, this is the header for this text, and this text is uh, the same text on the panel. Okay, um, very very important. Enable execute code and enable uh, execute code for accessibility. Okay, this is for uh, set the text the first code is the set the text of the um, uh, tab okay on the of this tab content okay this is the header to set this text in this element okay very very important and I make this from this way because if the uh, elements are different okay you can see that this change the height okay and um, I don't use a position absolute because it's a bad practice and don't work very well uh, okay uh, remember enable and don't change the classes and name classes uh, for this uh, you can click on the okay on the um, tab okay in the stable tab click on the class and you can change the padding the background the border okay typography um, on active and then um, the styles okay it's very very easy um, okay this is the tab uh, menu okay this is the um, header and the titles and the button okay at the end if you don't need a button you can delete this button uh, okay this is header is very very important that you don't delete this you can click on the header uh, click on the uh, class okay you can change the row gap okay the, on the in this text okay the large out okay on margin button on the css okay this is only for change the uh, the tab okay with i click on other tab okay click you can see that this have um transition okay for opacity uh, okay it's not necessary that you change this and um, this is the way to edit okay on the heading click on the class and you can set styles okay on intro click on the class and change the styles and um, very very important uh, that change this and if you can see that the the pane okay and the header is the same class okay the, the same class from here and same class from here um, when you edit this okay the class and you set the elements that you like you can delete the heading text okay you can delete this and you can delete the text intro okay and save okay save and in the front end okay I will reload 
and now you can see that this take the text from uh, the content on the uh, pane okay from here okay this is the header you can see that for example the, the first okay this is heading for example one I will reload in this case uh, I am heading uno but I change this for heading one okay you can see that this uh, uh, set the content okay on the tabs Okay, uh, this is the most uh, uh, difficult part of, the, of this template, but the other elements are very, very easy. Okay, this is the image. Uh, if you need add other uh, content, okay, duplicate this or duplicate this. And this is only for uh, the image and the okay this is the two okay this is a video okay you can change the the video if you need one uh, section with video you can duplicate this or if you need only one section with the image okay duplicate this and very very important this content uh, will set in this header uh, okay uh, this is the way to edit this template um the rest is very very easy okay the icon the name okay on the title this is a future okay if you need a uh, other future okay change this name okay for new for future for um, okay um, the future element you can duplicate this and duplicate this or you can delete the future uh, back if you don't like and this is the way to edit this template and uh, this is all okay i hope you like this uh, um if you need i'm sorry i if you need a uh, set um, query loop and dynamic content you can click on the title okay click on the title delete these elements okay on the title enable the query loop and in this case i will set the pose okay only uh, for post okay now this is for post i will set the name okay on the name i will set the post title okay now you can see that this work um if you need set the for this uh, i you can delete this delete this only set one pane and enable query loop okay in this case post i will set the same number of the post on the title okay and now I have say um, four posts on the image okay I will delete this I will set um, the future image okay for the image on the header I will set the um, the hidden okay well, I will set uh, okay a dynamic uh, content I will set uh, for example um, the post date okay and the intro i will set um other metadata okay but in this case i will set other element for example the excerpt okay post excerpt uh i will delete i will delete this okay i copy the class on the intro and set the same class on this excerpt okay and uh, on the excerpt i will set um, for example 16 and now uh, save and i will go to the front end okay reload okay you can see this is the uh, the, the, um, um, the content okay for the post and this is the titles okay of post title and you can see that this work and work with a uh, dynamic data and this is the future image and this is the way to uh, set a query loop in this template okay now i hope you like this tutorial and see you in the next video bye